Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the eighth tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we'll be checking out some more tags in HTML. So I've got a document here and uh, on line one in this file I have the doc type declaration and between the HTML opening and closing tags I have the head section which has the title uh, strike through superscript and subscript tags between the opening and closing title tags and then the body section I have uh, three paragraphs again just as I had in the last tutorial with some uh, more tags in between the opening and closing paragraph tags. So I have the strike tag, uh, you know, the opening strike tag and the closing strike tag between the opening and closing paragraph tags uh, on line number seven. And uh, what feature will this result into? Uh, I'm sure you are aware of the strike through style in Microsoft Word, right? So if you want some text and if you want that text to be striked out, then you have to use the strike tag. And, uh, you know, I'll show you guys how the file looks in Google Chrome in just a moment. Let me talk about the other two tags uh, that are new in this tutorial, uh, you know, before showing you the file in Google Chrome. So I have the superscript tag uh, on line number eight, and uh, we're meeting this tag for the first time in this tutorial. And, uh, you know, if suppose you want to have an expression like three cube equals 27, right? So three to the power three. And, uh, you know, I'm sure you guys know that when you have something in, in, you know, as a part of something, you have it kind of elevated. So, you know, it's superscript basically. And uh, to have that effect, you use the SUP tag. So I have three, the opening SUP tag, and then the closing SUP tag. And between these two, I have another three, right? So one three will be at the base level and another three will be at a slightly elevated level. So, you know, this will result into the expression three cube equals 27. And then I also have the, uh, you know, subscript tag uh, used for the first time in the course on line number nine, right? So between the opening and closing paragraph tags, I have A subscript A times B subscript B equals C subscript C, right? It's not uh, a known expression, I've just created one. So now let me show you guys how this file looks in Google Chrome, this is how it looks. So the first, uh, you know, paragraph has a text, no kidding, which is striked out. And the second one has, uh, you know, the expression three cube equals 27. And the last paragraph has uh, the expression A subscript A times B subscript B equals C subscript C. And, uh, you know, subscript is actually uh, like just as superscript is uh, text elevated, subscript is text, uh, you know, like at a lower level, right? So I hope you guys had fun watching this tutorial and you may subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next tutorial in which we'll discuss more features of HTML, more tags, and uh, that's it. Take care and uh, have fun.